Go what are you trying to hide? You don't touch her. What don't you want people okay, to Call see? the authorities. If we're not allowed to, call the you authorities. You can't feed our thing. animals. There's definitely upwards of 50 animals. There's probably cows all on that whole top. It's a double decker. The last transport, there were three dead ones. They came from Ontario, so they've probably been on the truck for at least one to two days with no food, no water, and they're just on top of each other and they can't barely move. Basically, they're just waiting to go inside, and then once they go inside, they get killed. See, there's a few down cows in there. They didn't make the trip just from exhaustion and restlessness and hunger and fear. I mean, they know what's about to happen. sleep at night and I'm like they're probably loading the animals right now <laughs> they're just like starved on their way here it's like can we do anything worse to them whoa 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 you're gonna what are you how do you know in there get that water out of here what do you got think it's water it's how do I know spray. you think we're poisoned the and they show up here dead it's pulling spring cases. You can what look are you on trying the to side. hide? You don't no, touch no, no. her. What don't you want people okay, to Call see? the authorities. If we're not allowed to, call the you authorities. You can't feed That's our animals. It. We're not feeding we're them. Not feeding we're them. giving it's water. dehydrated this is a basic animals right water. for anybody. They've been on the truck all How night, right? How do I right? know what's in your water? We don't care. Come on, get away from my trailer. We're not touching your trailer. You're we're not touching my animals. Actually, we're not. You have no right. You're dropping them off to their death. They're not yours. Where do you come up with this stuff? Listen, we all used to eat animal if, products. How do you think most people would react if this truck were filled with dogs and cats? What would you give a shit? You don't think people would give a shit? I don't care what you think about dogs or cats. Do they feel pain? Yeah, they have a perfect in it. They're, they're, they're fine. Do they suffer? Do they have the capacity to suffer? Well, anything has capacity to suffer. Why don't you go to China and try doing this? Because there's people in China, from China, doing it. I'm from here, I'm here. They, they put a bullet in it. That's the they problem. Will. They don't tolerate that. You know, here we're, we're kind and put up with you. Wait, there's some people here trying to go to work, trying to make a living, and you idiots are out here. You're rotten from the inside out. You can have that on camera. I don't care what you do. Where are you going to put that on you? You do, but who's going to watch it? People like you. That's fine. This man brings animals to their death. Yes, absolutely, and I love it. Yes, I feed people. I've been coming here for about a year, every other Thursday. I think this is the least that we can do, and just by putting this on our social media, when people actually make the connection and see the victim behind who they're eating, that's what it was for me. I was actually on a highway and I saw one of these trucks drive by and it was filled with pigs and my dog was sitting next to me in the car and I looked at her and I looked back at the truck at the pig in there and I looked in one of their eyes and I just I made the connection and I was like, there's no difference. They both want to live, they both want to be loved. Why do we eat one and, and love another? Look at his eyes. Look at him, he's so He's in so much pain. Like, I wish I could do something. It's like we can't, we can't do anything except be here. I, I, I know how it looks in there. I love the animals. So that's, why, that's why we raise them. Because we actually know how, we know how it works. We love them. Right. The 
feed them. That's the only reason they're alive. They're raised. You love your children too, I guess, Are right? You do you send them, them to the slaughterhouse? Oh, no. How do you no, kill something no. that you love? No, you're an idiot. Maybe I'm an idiot. Yeah, put it on this earth for us to eat. That's who? Who said that? Even if they were, if we have the option to not do that, why don't we do that? Okay, we can't. We're to death. We're all vegan. We all are yeah, but thriving. That, you know, you're... We're not starving to death. No, you're not thriving. You don't know anything about any of us. Now there's child abuse right there. The driver's inside the truck now. Definitely killing them in there already. I know they're dumping. They're dumping. So this is their intestines. A lot of the time it's heads and hooves. Sometimes you'll see an ear tag with their letter. That was an entire corpse that just fell from there. Sometimes the animal, they don't make it inside, they don't make it overnight because the conditions are so horrific inside there as well that they'll die and then they'll just dump their bodies in there. They'll cover them in ammonia and then these trucks get sent to rendering plants where they turn it into different soaps and dog food, cat food. It's one after the other. I mean, you'll just see barrels with like guts and hooves. Thank you. 